We went to a lab and we got results. Now this started as a simple email, but then it transformed into a months long odyssey as we sought the truth. The things you want to know, we go the extra step and we get them verified. This question, easy enough, is it safe, sanitary? to drink a bottle of water and then fill it up out of the tap and use it again. In order to go deeper, we made a Verify house call. Hello, Bernie. thank you so much for coming. Nice to meet you. Let's do this. Our Verify team, we popped into Bernie Gilliam's home in Alexandria. Debate over whether or not water bottles are safe to use after you use the initial water that you bought in them. Bernie and her husband, who we'll meet later, they don't exactly see eye to eye on this whole refilling water bottle thing. He thinks reusing those bottles isn't healthy. He said he heard a news article somewhere or some type of clip or something. I don't know, he didn't remember. I just refused to throw them away the first time. It just doesn't make sense to me. Water is already in them. Why not fill them with water again? No contamination. Danger. These are going to the lab. <laughs> okay. We fill, fill the bottles with water. We culture it for two, uh, 72 hours to make sure there's, if there is any bacteria growing it. And I'm going to swish it up so it's all evenly dispersed. There are microscopic bits of bacteria in our water. The EPA says anything less than 500 bits in your tap and bottled water is good to go. Because they're microscopic, you can't see them. But our Verify lab test reveals the ugly truth. I'm at the Aerobiology Laboratory in Dulles in Northern Virginia and we have the results of the water bottle testing. The answers are inside of this box, and spoiler alert, it's nasty. So we are now set up here in our main studio at WUSA 9 to reveal the results of our water bottle testing. Come on down, guys. Bernie in Toronto here with us. So guys, this has been a long time coming. You guys have had this mm -hmm. long running debate. I don't see the reason not to reuse the bottle bottle. Okay, now this water bottle is mine. This one okay. is Staff Sergeant McNasty, okay? Yeah. This one has been reused for like six months. Oh my gracious, okay. okay? Without okay. being cleaned or nothing. The results of mine were not that great. Oh. Ooh. Ooh. Yuck. 2,560 micro dots of bacteria. Absolutely. In Captain McNasty. Here. Terrible. Okay. So now we look at my water bottle, Bernie, mm -hmm. and we look at yours. So how are you feeling about this right Can't now? Wait. What are you thinking it's going to show? <laughs> that it's okay to reuse. Okay. Toronto, what are you thinking at this point? I don't think it's okay to constantly reuse. All right, well, now we're going to show you. Okay. After all the months of waiting, Bernie. Ta da! Show that yours was the nastiest of all. Ah! <laughs> I was right. I was right. I was right. 4,680 oh micro dots of bacteria. Worse than anybody's. Nine times the EPA acceptable amount. All right. Well, you apologize. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'll no. recycle the water bottles. Mm -hmm. No more reusing water bottles. With a big, watery whammo, it's verified. Our reused water bottles are loaded with bacteria. So pretty gross, right? Maybe you're thinking, no way I'll ever reuse a water bottle again. But here's the thing. For people like me and Bernie, who reuse those bottles over and over again, we're not getting sick. Why? Well, because not all bacteria is bad. Bacteria are introduced possibly into the water bottle from our own mouths. It's highly unlikely that you may have a disease-causing organism in that water bottle. So Dr. Sapkota says your chances of getting sick increase if you share a bottle of water or a drink with somebody else. So while we can verify, yes, those reused bottles are riddled with bacteria, we can also verify, boom, your chances of getting sick are extremely low if you're the only one drinking from that bottle. So Bernie, Toronto, turns out you were both right. <laughs>